All right, what's up everybody? Uh, welcome back to another video. Today, I'm gonna be going over why I think that vanilla is the best game mode and why I think that you should probably switch to it or at least give it a try, see how you like it. Um, hope you enjoy. Okay, so when I'm playing vanilla, here's what I notice. When I get a kill, it means something. When I die, it means something. When you're in modded, that means nothing, right? When you die in modded, you say, all right, let me TP back to you, I'll get my stuff. Or you say, oh, hey, we died, dude, that's gonna be 10 minutes worth of looting that we gotta do again. When you die in vanilla, it's, okay, dude, let's resupply a base, but I mean, we gotta stock up again because we're running out of gear, all right? So it actually means something when you die in vanilla. And, um, you know, that's hours of work is just one gear set in vanilla versus five minutes in modded, right? And when you kill somebody in modded, you're gonna say, it's the exact same concept is, hey, this was 10 minutes worth of his time that we don't have to spend anymore because we just got a dragon fang and a grizzly. When you're playing vanilla and you kill somebody with that loot, you just get this rush, this joy that you just, you can't experience when you're playing a modded server. You just can't. It's so much different. and. I ask you to please try vanilla to experience this for yourself but oh my gosh when you kill somebody in vanilla and they have that grizzly that honey badger that dragon fang you know that you're set and you got to get straight back to base and you got to drop this but you got to drop this off show all your teammates you know you just don't get that in modded right in modded if that happens you just slash home you drop it off at your sky base and you fall out and that brings me to my next topic which is sky bases is in vanilla your base is basically everything you got to find out how to perfectly place your base on the map so that nobody's gonna find it you have to find out how to perfectly reinforce it so nobody's gonna get to your loot on modded you just play some plates in the sky and that's it and you know it's gonna leave a ton of debris in the sky and it just lags up the server it looks bad and you know there's just no skill to building your base in modded it's just let's let's get as high as we can into the sky and let's build some plates and it's just not the experience that anybody should want you know in vanilla you like you want your base to be a good experience when you're playing a survival game and you don't even get that in modded and my next topic is player interactions okay now this is huge because when you're playing a pvp modded server you're just going for kills right so you're like if you see a naked he's dead Okay, there's no player interaction whatsoever. There's no friendliness, there's no allying. It's all just kill, kill, kill. When you're on vanilla, look, for me personally, I play a lot of vanilla. Probably two thirds of my entire gameplay has been on vanilla. And I know for a fact that player interactions are huge, right? Because on vanilla, you don't wanna get raided. You're gonna try and ally with the good people on the server, be neighbors with somebody. You're gonna do whatever you can, right? I know. On my server in the past week I've played I've met so many new play people that I play with regularly now not like like in the same group but when they're on the service like hey do you want to meet up want to go do a horde beacon want to go loot military base you know it's just this player interaction that you don't get and modded and not to mention I even found somebody to be neighbors with right I mean you just don't get that in modded and you will never be able to get that modded and that's why i think people need to try vanilla it's just the experience that nelson was looking for when he made the game and that's why that's why that's the vanilla you know it's not altered at all it's just what the game is and what it was supposed to be and i think by making these uh, pvp modded servers you're straying farther away from what the game was meant for and i'm hoping that nelson's gonna bring this back in 4.0 but guys when 4.0 does come out try not to bring back these modded servers so this is what ruined the game you realize that the game is dying very quickly this is because these modded servers these new players that are coming to experience the game for the first time join these modded servers where everybody's just killing and killing and killing and there's no survival aspect to the game and they just say look this game is boring and they just quit and other people are just playing these modded because that's what everybody's on and they're realizing it's boring and they're quitting the game and it's killing the game and like I said, I hope Nelson is going to bring back this survival back in 4.0. But please, let's not stray farther away from what the game is supposed to be and bring back vanilla. I will leave my server IP and port in the description if you want to join my vanilla server. But there's, I mean, there's probably like five Washington vanilla servers out there total. So you don't really have much choice. So I will leave my uh, IP and port in the description if you want to join. 
I uh, hope you enjoyed. Um, if you agree or disagree, let me know in the comments why you do disagree or agree. Uh, but yeah, hope you enjoyed.